American people are facing a president and vice president that allow people to live and let live, love and let love, and be who they are underneath their guise of America. You see, in America, we have always said, let freedom reign. But freedom ringing is not your opportunity to allow your liberties to cross over the line into other people's lives. The liars of America can put on the sweetest smile for your company and they can still participate in local abuses and local power withholdings. A power withholding is a man or woman that insists on paying for someone without their permission or consent. The person will say no thank you several times, yet that individual will refuse to take their money. The liars of America are misrepresenting their national corporations and they are abusing people like you and me. When a man wants to pay for himself, it's not a matter of humility and it's not a matter of pride. It's a matter of ability that I've finally gotten myself to a position where I can pay for me, but you want to insult me and say that I can't. But then you want to abuse me in the middle of the night with your black hands of Satan that cuts my beard off at night. Your lying ways have created a social network across different companies and different white trash people. No offense, but it's a white trash individual that refuses to hear the answer no. It's a form of rape of rights. So we're talking about rape of rights today. At no time do you have the right to pay for someone without their consent or permission, especially if you're participating in the absolute abuse of their name, abuse of their property, abuse of their person. Do I make myself clear or are you that stupid about human trafficking here? Human trafficking is the sexual inappropriate touch of a human being. Human trafficking is the cutting off of any secondary sex characteristics or the debilitating of someone to the point that they don't know what you're doing to them. The liars of America live in the police force. The liars in America live in the sheriff's force. I am a huge, absolute proponent of defund the police for how much has been stolen from me in my own shelter, my own storage unit, and my own situation by police. And openly, I will never change my mind on this. They can continue hitting, they can continue abusing, they can continue lying to themselves about their rights, but there is at some point a higher law enforcement network that will start to pay attention to what is and isn't right. Even the liars of America walk through the White House. And they walk through the White House saying, we support this, and then they send their little trash-ass bastards to our community to abuse us. The liars of America are in any trans group, any gay group, any Christian group, any retail group, and these are the liars of America. I've met many of them. I've tried to articulate the problems to their company, but their companies would prefer to attack a person like me who's indigent instead of hold their children who work for their corporations to a higher standard than most people. Isn't that the problem with America? That a corporation will turn their head and allow something to go on that should not be going on in their stead because they're so lacking of employees.